Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a really exciting comparison video for you all. And it is going to be on the Too Faced Christmas Snuggles and Melted Kisses. I actually have had this for a couple weeks now and I finally am using it today. And I'm gonna compare it to the 2018 four piece kit that came out just like this one. And they are all different except for one. They did repeat sugar cookie, which I'm not mad about because I love sugar cookie. It is seriously a great nude. It is one of those nudes you're gonna keep in your purse, keep in your work bag, just bring it for travel, everyday kind of nude shade. And I'm not mad about that they repeated that shade. Of all the shades, I'm really, really happy because that is a shade that I would want to keep in multiple places, keep in your car, what have you. It's just a really, really good shade. I really enjoy the Too Faced Melted Liquid Lipsticks. I think it is a great formula. I enjoy them personally and I have tons of them. And when I saw that they came out with this kit, I was like, oh my gosh, of all the Christmas kits, this is what I really wanted. And I'm just really excited. I am wearing one of the new shades that's in this new pack here. So I'm gonna swatch all four, except for sugar cookie, cause they're the same, but I'll swatch it, but I don't need to compare it obviously. But just so you guys can see the differences, I'm really happy that I got in on the 2018 pack. 2019, I think they came out with like a lip gloss set and I was bummed that they didn't do this again. Gummy, what is it? Cinnamon Bear. I was gonna say Gummy Bear, but Cinnamon Bear, they did repeat this year and it came out with its own palette and you can get a full size of this and the palette with a little bag, I think for like $39, which I don't know, that's a pretty good deal because just a full size alone is 20 something dollars so it's a great great deal and cinnamon bear is really pretty and i'm looking forward to comparing it to candy cane so i haven't swatched these this is definitely kind of like a first impressions for my comparison and then they also repeated pumpkin spice which i'm not gonna lie i was really happy that i already had this so i didn't feel like i had to buy another liquid lipstick so i was really really excited that i already had this in my collection and i was like ooh. And then they also um, have hot buttered rum, which is so pretty. I wore this in one of my last videos and then obviously sugar cookie. So then in the new set for 2020, we got hot toddy, which I'm actually wearing today. And it is so pretty. Oh my gosh, I am in love. And then we have candy cane. Then we have sugar cookie and then caramel apple, which I am really, really intrigued to try this. So this is probably gonna be the next one that I have put on, the <laughs> next time I put on lipstick. So I'm so excited. I just find these liquid lipsticks to be super comfortable. You don't have to dip in multiple times. I did this all on just one application. I didn't have to re-dip. I feel like it doesn't feather. It just looks good throughout the day. It's not heavy doesn't like stick it dries down really really quickly i and it never gets on my teeth which i love i love a liquid lipstick that does dry down quickly i mean unless maybe you are very slow at application but even so it it's like the the drying quickness doesn't like ruin the application at all. I just love the fact that in instant, it's dry, you are ready to go, and they wear really nicely throughout the day. I've been using these Too Faced uh, Melted Liquid Lipsticks for years and years and years. I have Gingerbread Man, I have Gingerbread Girl, I have the Melted Metallics, which are phenomenal. So again, I, these are tried and true for me, and I've enjoyed these a lot over the years. So let me swatch the 2018 ones, and then I'll swatch the 2020 ones next to them, and I will go through them so let's do sugar cookie so there's sugar cookie beautiful 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 nude and i'll obviously show these to you when they dry down and these all have a different scent which i absolutely love and what i also love about the Too Faced uh christmas is that they do repeat like these shades like hot buttered rum so this one's hot buttered rum here and they came out with a palette i think that was last year and i do regret not getting it i mean i can live without it but it's just so pretty and that palette is beautiful but i love how they do the spin-offs of the shades that they came out with prior and then they do a spin-off and i think that's a smart idea for a company because then you see like do people really like this shade you know can, what can we do this is pumpkin spice that again came out this year with a pumpkin spice palette 
And so I really do like how they kind of, you know, they do like the spin off. So that's pumpkin spice. Really, really pretty. I feel like on me, on my lips, it does come off a little bit more pink than I would say like an orange. And then this one is cinnamon bear. And this, oh, it smells so good. So I don't know. I think it's just really exciting that they do do the spinoffs. I think that's just I think it's just a lot of fun. So that is Cinnamon Bear. So now I'm gonna swatch the new ones for 2020, except for Sugar Cookie because I don't want to open that one yet. I'm kind of I'm just gonna save that. Whether I give it away, probably not. But I'm probably gonna put it in like my handbag or something. Okay. So Candy Cane. I don't know, I kind of hope they come up with like a candy cane collection. So I'm really excited for next year, I know, right? Just enjoy 2020 as much as we can. Um, so I'm really excited to see like what spinoffs. So candy cane is definitely like a brighter pinky red. Definitely different than cinnamon bear. So here is candy cane and this is cinnamon bear. So you can see how much brighter, it's almost like a bright pink red, it, exactly. Okay, and then we're going to do caramel apple. I'm trying to like match them up sort of how they might be a little bit similar, but these are definitely different. But I was really interested to see how the reds compare. Oh my gosh, this caramel apple shade. So pretty. So this is caramel apple. Caramel apple. This is pumpkin spice. And then this one is hot buttered rum. So you can see how that compares to those. And then last but not least, what I have on is hot toddy. Oh my gosh. And this smells, this smells so good. Mmm. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Oh, this is so pretty. So pretty. I'm really excited to try the um, caramel apple. So that is hot toddy. So pretty. So we have candy cane, cinnamon apple, caramel apple, hot toddy, pumpkin spice, hot butter rum, and sugar cookie. Oh my gosh, so, so gorgeous. I mean, of course it's like, I wish they would have done something differently than Sugar Cookie again, but if they were gonna repeat anything from 2018, I'm happy they did repeat Sugar Cookie because that is a color that you can wear daily, every day, all occasions, all day long, night, day, and it's just a color you're gonna get a lot of use out of. So I'm really not mad about it because again, it is a color that I would want to have like in my handbag, work bag, car, stuff like that, have one in my vanity, that sort of thing. It's kind of like how I feel about Pillow Talk from Charlotte Tilbury. I want that shade in literally every handbag I own, every spot I'm at, because I love that shade. So again, Sugar Cookie, it is a really, really great nude. So if you already love it, I mean, again, it's a just, a good color to have. Maybe not have multiple, especially if you already have a ton of lipsticks, but it, it, it is a pretty color. So if you really want the other ones, you're not really, in my opinion, you're not really wasting your money. So this kit is a great, great value. I believe this is $25. And to get four different colors, again, unless you already have the 2018 version, but I mean, it comes in a cute set. This makes a great gift to buy one for yourself, buy one for your friend. I mean, this is just a really, really nice gift. And especially, you know, if you have a coworker that wears a lot of lipsticks, you know, especially someone that you know that likes lipstick, this is just a nice little gift. I mean, $25, I don't think is breaking the bank, I guess maybe depending on how many people you have to shop for, but, or if you have a lot of nieces that love makeup, like this is just so, so good. And yeah, I don't know. I'm just, and the formula is fantastic. So again, I have hot toddy on and I love it. So I definitely think it's worth the money. I definitely think they are different enough if you have the 2018 version. And even if you have gingerbread girl and gingerbread man, they're completely different. It's just so, so pretty. Oh my gosh, so pretty. I was just trying to wait for them to dry down. But Candy Cane, I am so excited for, oh my gosh, I'm so excited for Candy Cane. That is just so gorgeous. And honestly, Cinnamon Bear does look brighter in the tube, but it definitely comes off a lot deeper, especially when it's compared to Candy Cane. So I am just really excited. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to start using these. And I have been using the 2018 version of the, like not really much cinnamon bear lately, but especially the hot butter rum, pumpkin, 
Spice and Sugar Cookie Gate. I've been wearing these three a lot lately. This had definitely been a favorite for September and October because when I saw that they came out with this new one, I'm like, oh my gosh, let me enjoy my 2018 ones too. And I love these. These were always in my work bag. I completely enjoy these and love them. So I really, really hope that this video really helps you out to decide, but also to decide, do you need it? Do you not need it? I mean, obviously we don't need anything. And probably the last thing we all need is probably more lip colors. But in case you are on the fence, this is a good one put it on your christmas list birthday if your birthday is this time of year but it's a really really good one so anyway guys let me know what your thoughts are below and let me know what gift sets that you guys are really lusting after and dreaming about because i just feel like this year maybe just because i i don't know i'm going to be doing a video on um like decluttering i've decluttered a lot of stuff out of my makeup collection and i'm actually gonna be filming an intro for that soon probably after this and I don't know, I'm kind of viewing definitely makeup a lot differently. So, you know, how do you guys feel about the Christmas collections? Because I'm not feeling that hyped about it. I feel like the only thing I'm really thinking about is the Too Faced Salted Caramel little eyeshadow palette. And I do have my $10 birthday reward. So I'm thinking about just using it on that because I really, really want it. And I don't want to just get something to get something. So that's the only thing I'm really, really lusting after. And I feel like I've watched a lot of reviews on it and the quality and the pigmentation seem amazing. So let me know if you guys have that palette and if you would recommend it for me, because I really do like warm tones. So I will definitely get my use out of it. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys all in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram at HKSocko. See you guys. Bye.